Okay, so I'm back, and uh, here I am with an update. Um, with uh, I'm going to break down what I've done when I last did a um, shot of this. You saw it was pretty much um, an outline, and so with the with the technique I'm using, which is there again, it's called an oil wash technique. Um, you're going to see there again. There's the image. So. Sorry, it's not the. It's a good reference, but I, I usually prefer my references like in color and a little larger because I always tell people when I'm doing um, an image and trying to get a likeness, the better the reference is, then the better I can kind of do my job of getting a likeness. Um, I so in this particular stage, I think I captured him uh, pretty well. Um, there's you know the eyes, it gives you close up of the eyes and mustache and so forth. Black and white image, no problem. Um, when it comes to color, I, I usually don't have an issue with that. The top of the head is not done because there again, he's going to be wearing a, a beret. Um, so in this image, what you're going to see, there again, here's the picture of his son. And I'm going to be pretty much, uh, with this technique, the overall face is going to be like oil washed. Uh, what you do is like, I'm a, now that I've done a light pencil drawing here, and the, the pencil drawing doesn't have to be really tight a tight rendering just an, enough for me to like I said get the likeness because what I'm going to be, be doing is when I um, I'm going to lay a s spray over this it's going to seal down the graphite I, I just used a regular old raggedy that's a beat up number two pencil so I, you don't have to get to um, you know some people use ebony's or or the pencils a number two pencils just enough all you need to get, to get the graphite in there and then I'm going to spray work fixative over this that's going to seal down the graphite and then what I'll do is I'll mix up an oil wash uh, it'll be turpentine and some oils that'll be close to his skin tone once I get a color reference I'm going to wash that over just the facial area here and then the rest of what you see behind this whole image is going to be painted with uh, acrylic paint so you know like the tie even though I did do some tone some, some tone variation there or light shading it doesn't really matter because all that's going to be painted like this whole suit tie um, shirt beret the background which is going to have the American flag all of that's going to be painted in and I'm going to probably walk through some of that process but um yeah I'll, I'll definitely do that just so you can actually see the transformation even more uh, but this is what it looks like now this is where I'm at there again this is just a really light outline and um, I'm going to go to the I guess third or fourth stage of this to bring this into more of um, a solid image so that I can capture exactly what was expressed by the uh, the daughter as to what she what she wanted him to look like in the final uh, memorial piece 